My beloved child, open your ears and listen attentively as I, your Lord God, speak directly to you. God message for you today. The truth is, it's the little things you do every day that will make a big difference. Your life is continuously being built out of tiny pieces of time. Ultimately, at the end of your life, all you will be left with is the journey. It will be the time spent on becoming what you are that will make up your life. So, make the most of each precious moment and remember, it's the little things you do every day that really make a huge difference. Like this video, if you have a believe in God, God is saying to you today, so this is your life, and you are going to be both moved and confused by it. You are going to experience things that will inspire you, and things that you will never quite come to terms with. You are going to love people that you will sometimes lose, but you will also find those who stay. You are going to laugh until you cry. You are going to ache in ways you never thought possible. You are going to be exhausted by the chaos of it all and ignited by the beauty. You are going to be hurt, and you are going to hurt. Sometimes you will have to give yourself your own closure. Sometimes you will have to let go. Sometimes you will have to find comfort in being alone, in being lost. Yes, this is your life. And though it can be unpredictable and messy, even though it can break you down, you are going to survive it. You will always survive it. Type 11. 11 to claim it. Today's God message for you, in the end. All the small things make a big difference. Every step is crucial. Life isn't about a single moment of great triumph. It's about the trials and errors that slowly get you there. The blued, sweet, tears, and the small, inconsequential things you do on a day-to-day -day basis. It all matters in the end. Every step, every regret, every decision, every minor setback and minuscule win. All of this has strengthened you. All of this has led you to every success you've ever had. All of this has made you who you are today, and all of this proves that you have the strength to deal with the challenges that are in front of you. Type 2, 2, 2, to affirm this to yourself. Today's message for you, you learn a lot about yourself through connection with someone else. You'll learn tolerance, you'll learn understanding, you'll learn patience, you'll learn acceptance, you'll learn grace, but most of all you'll learn love. And in the bigger picture and grander scheme of things, that's all that truly matters. Subscribe our channel if you love God. Universe message, just know that every time you try to put even your little toe outside of your comfort zone, your brain will completely freak out and try to convince you to stay in the world, you know, and that's okay. Your brain freaking out isn't a sign something's wrong. Life-changing moments come from doing the things you're scared to do. So don't let fear throw you off your path. Type, I am ready to shine, to affirm. Angel's message tonight, timeless truth. When you put out good, good will come back in some way, shape, or form. It may not be immediate, but your acts never go unnoticed and will find their way to you. It's never for nothing or wasted energy. Continue to live and love well from the heart and always feel blessed and grateful for all that is given back in return. Type yes.
if you feel this. Today's message, it's your attitude that counts in everything you do, however important or mundane. The thing is, it's your attitude that can make it better regardless of the outcome. Next time things are a little off, or you're having trouble finding the joy in what you're doing, question your attitude. You may need to adjust your approach to things and situations accordingly, especially when all seems lost and there are moments of despair. It's your attitude that will keep you there until you become self-aware. Don't wait for things to get easier, simpler, better. Life will always be complicated. Look for small opportunities for happiness in the moment you are in right now. Otherwise, you might run out of time. We can't often choose our circumstances, but we can better control our reactions and emotions. Choose small moments of joy. Type 5, 5, 5 if you trust God. Today's God message for me you get to choose how you see your life. And so I hope you choose to see serendipity. I hope that when something beautiful happens, you take it as a confirmation. And when something hard happens, you take it as a moment to rest and heal. I hope you choose to put together the pieces. I hope you seek understanding. I hope you find little wells of joy that may spring up through the day. I hope you feel a connection where others see separation. I hope you discover things you never knew you'd want to come. I hope you know that a thousand failures are the building blocks of your becoming. I hope you know that it is the courage to keep beginning that ultimately gets us all where we are meant to be. God message for you, Pather, than trying to know and figure it all out. Live in the curiosity of it all. You don't have to know where you'll be a year from now. You don't even have to know what you'll be doing a month from now. Move away from this need for certainty that we all have and move toward the curiosity that we all need. Just be. Live in the moment with every bit of your life force and enjoy the gift of the present. The treasures of your life will present themselves to you only if you really are open to them. Instead of focusing on what you think you're not, focus on what you are. Let go the chase for perfection and embrace your true authentic self. Look at your strengths, uniqueness, and qualities. Mistakes don't mean the end of the world. Stop shaming or guilt-tripping yourself because it's a trauma response that comes from a belief that you have to be perfect. Be yourself courageously. To support our channel, please subscribe our channel and turn on bell notification.